I hope you love some theater because you are listening to Keith Price's Curtain Call. This is Keith Price for Keith Price's Curtain Call, and we are at the press room for the big Fantastic Drama Desk Awards, and I'm having a great time because I'm speaking to the outstanding lighting designer of not only a play, but a musical. I guess now two-time Drama Desk Award winning <laughs> lighting designer, Justin Townsend. How you doing? I'm just, I'm, I'm just, I'm speechless. It's just Wait, where are your awards? They don't give them to you. You have to have a dummy, and then they take it away, and then they they, they, they don't let me have one. Those bastards. Those bastards. It's all going to be great. It's all gonna are they going to mail it to you after? I assume so. Yes, okay. they'll, they'll mail it. It'll right. be great. So here you are. You have won for both categories, musical and a play. Um, does it get any better than that in the night? You know, I, I'm still... It's been amazing when I moved here, I don't know, two decades ago, to think of and start to make New York home. And to be able to be to, to have this amazing honor and recognition of winning two uh, drama desks in one night, I'm just, I'm just besides myself, and, and especially on two pieces that I just think the world of, both the writing, the directing, they're just, uh, they're, they're just A-list uh, productions that I'm so proud of. He's talking about American Psycho, which unfortunately just closed today, right? Yeah. Damn it which I've seen, so I'm good, The Humans, which people are still talking about. People are, you, you were with it from the Off-Broadway production as well? I had a chance to make it at the Roundabout Theater, uh, and then we moved it uh, to the Helen Hayes. Right. And uh, I've been with, the, with it the whole time, and with the, with the same company building it from the beginning. Right. When we were rehearsing without any lights in the very beginning, this, just the set, <laughs> and we slowly added in the lighting into it to make the project happen. It was a very, very unique and special construction. I love it. It's all because, again, for this piece, if you haven't seen it, it's all about that last scene in the hallway with... The are we sure it's the Asian woman with the the cart? I don't know, but she's loud and annoying throughout the play. But there she is. It's like, but why is she here? Why is she walking? Like, how, what kinds of questions do you have to ask yourself when you're creating those kinds of moments? Well, I, I love the idea that we. It, it seems like a very straightforward play. It's a play about Thanksgiving. It's a family coming together, and then slowly the rug is so slowly snuck out from underneath us. And all of a sudden, it, I, 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 it starts to feel like to me that we're playing with bigger ideas, the sort of the, uh, of what it means to be um, uh, trying to get ahead in New York. What does it mean to be uh, 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 living and working here? For you, though, now, <laughs> I'm thinking, how bad have your Thanksgivings been? <laughs> you know, I'm very lucky to have a great family, but it's funny to hear some of the stories and to watch, all, watch it all uh, unfold. I love it, though. So, Justin, now you, you are enjoying this time right now with, with your designs. What do you have coming up to look forward to in this next season? You know, I can't wait to make uh, David Byrne's new musical at the Public uh, St. Joan with Alex Timbers. That's oh. just going to be a really, really special production. Uh, and then, of course, I'll go and do Joe Hodge's production out at the Guthrie next, uh, just for a little summer break, uh, to do South Pacific with him. So it's a really, really great time right now, and I'm just, uh, just on, having a blast making great work with great people. Justin, thank you so much for taking time from me. This is great. Justin Townsend, you can come to New York and see his work right now in The Humans. I'm sorry to say that you've missed American Psycho, but I have a feeling that it's going to have another life somewhere else, if nothing, because it, it's just weird enough for people to want to know. I'm serious. I, you know, I'm speaking for the average person that goes to see a show. That It's just weird enough for them to be interested in it. So if you can get them to come and see it, that'll be the best thing. Justin Townsend, thank you so much. I hope you're enjoying Keith Price's Curtain Call.